This video covers the roles and responsibilities of a leader at the RDA. Attend the briefing and gather the information you will need. Collect the gear needed from the tack room. Saddles, head collars, and grooming kits are labeled for use with specific horses, while others have sizes indicated, like reins. Put the head collar on inside the stable with the gate shut. Never cross under the horse's neck, step around the front. Look out for signs that indicate annoyance. Your horse could be sensitive to aspects of the grooming process. The actual equipment used varies. Some riders require different gear, like special saddles or reins. Attach the reins to the head collar unless told otherwise. The warm-up is a good time to bond with your horse and see how it's behaving. During this time, make sure your horse is listening to you. Put on the vaulting girth before mounting if it's needed. Proper parking makes mounting safer and easier. Stay alert and in control of your horse. Avoid sharp turns and sudden starts and stops. Stay in control of your horse during mounting. Your main focus is the horse, but take the rider into account when planning transitions and turns. In the event of an unplanned incident, stay calm and settle your horse. At the end of the ride, the horses are lined up for dismounting. The instructor will dismount the riders. 
When the riders have dismounted and are clear of the arena, the instructor will allow leaders to lead their horses out. If there is no other ride, untack and groom your horse and return it to its stall. Remove the head collar, clean and return your horse's tack. At the debrief, report how your horse behaved during the session and if there were any incidents.